Hey folks, so uh, got this game here called 96 mil, which I don't think is 96 billion, but it's like a bill or something, like a, you know, a bill that makes stuff, and uh, it's some kind of horror type of adventure game, point and click, from 19, no oh, sorry, from 2016, so pretty new, so let's uh, start it out here and see what we got, hopefully my audio is working today. Recording log zero zero one. Frank Galvani. All right, let's see what we got here. Ninety-six so million. Nice voices on here. Site of Unified Electric Corporation or UEC. I'm in the south parking lot, south side of the complex, getting ready to go inside. The RDX should beep at you to give you this message. It's a little complicated, but it beats pencil and paper. The office should have given you a key to get through the outer gates. So once you're in. Come give me a hand. Oh, and listen, don't go messing around. Just come and find me. Like, this job isn't hard enough without fishing some rookie out of a dock trench. Okay, how do you stop this thing? <laughs> that was cute. So, basically, you're supposed to be this guy who's trying to, who's a demolitions expert. But I don't know what this interface is. Obviously, this is like, you know, a nice video here. It's a little, it's a little grainy for some reason. I guess these are places you can go. I don't know where they are because there's question marks there. And this is stuff I can look into more closely. Okay, so there's a van. Can I take the key? Uh, how do I take the key? Uh, okay. Let's try this again. There is a key. So click on here. All right, so now I took the key. All right. I guess that's the only thing you could do there. There's a dumpster. It made a nice sound effect, but nothing in the dumpster. So now I have a key. Oh, this is the thing I just listened to. Oh, okay, this is like my checklist. Find a way into the industrial complex. Find your voice. Frank, your boss, Frank Galvani, said all implosion charges. Because I can supposed to blow, the, blow this place up, apparently. Uh, this is, I guess, the guy talking. Log yeah, okay, so this zero, is... I, can, zero, I heard this already. I'm not going to listen to it again. Frank oh, Galvani. So we're going to stop it? All right, let's see what we got here. Stop, stop. Log oh, jeez. I guess you can't stop it once it starts going. Frank Galvani. All right, let's see what we got here. 96 mil. Right, All right, so let's try to move around electric here. Electric Corporation or UEC. I'll go this way first. Okay, stop talking at least. I went to the new thing. So I can look at this padlock. Just as the gate is locked. And I'm assuming this looks like a combination lock. What are these buttons over here? Uh, oh, it's like an auto map or something? That's interesting. I don't know what this icon here does. It looks like it should make it like full screen or something, but it seems to actually do nothing. Which obviously isn't very helpful. That's like a quick navigation feature. And this is the menu probably, right? Okay, yeah. Resume. Uh, what's this? That's my inventory. So I, I'm assuming I can't use the key on this lock. I guess I assumed wrong because you can use the key. <laughs> I think. Can I just, yeah, I went inside. I said, wait a second. What, what's all the other stuff that's out here? Overgrown lot. East gate. Overgrown path. Oh, it's the same it's the same lock, I guess, right? Shipping lot? No, it's not the same lot. Let's try to open it this with the same key. Oh, that works. There's multiple places you can go here. Commercial space for rent. <laughs> not anymore. UEC UEC. Hey Hopster Key Man, how's it going? This loading dock looks like crap now, and it's locked from the inside. Okay, so I'm, I'm at this, I'm playing this game where I'm, I'm a demolitions guy, I'm supposed to blow up some building, although, I don't know if it's this building, or a building behind me, or what, but, also, apparently the building's haunted, that's, that's the premise here. It's locked from the other side, I'm still trying to figure out the interface, but, I think I sort of figured it out. But I'm not sure. We're going to need a charge on that stack, we don't want it coming down in the river, the EPA is pretty strict on that. I like the voice acting in this game. It's like uh, the way that the, the guy sounds like, you know, sort of a natural guy. 
All right, so I'm supposed to blow this one up or implode it, but I don't have the explosives yet, I don't think. So I, I don't know if I went the wrong way or... Hey, rookie, if you're feeling ambitious and get this before you find me, get some charges out of the truck and start setting up. I've already is it Boston? a bunch of locations, so you'll know where to set them. What, this is like a Boston accent? Get some charges out of the truck. I think it's a Boston accent. All right. Oh, here's Frank's truck. So what's this? Steel bar. Implosion charges. Portable welding rig. Okay. Oh, there's more implosion charges. Okay, I got two of them. Uh, this is locked. This is locked. But this gate I should be able to open, right? With the key. Charges, yeah. <laughs> Officer key. They got some charges here. Blow up this thing. Okay, so I opened the key. Map updated. So, all right. So I can go left. This is where I came, I guess. What's this way? This is going around sure the building. charges on both ends of that sky bridge so it comes down squarely. The last thing we need is that to jam up on us. Okay. What about this? It's locked. So I put a charge here. So, okay. Implosion charge set. Do I leave one left now? Okay, I'm, I'm going to run out of these pretty quickly. What about this one? Removed. Oh. Huh? Let me removed. Not removed. Alright, I guess you, I used what I had. Listen, this place is huge. It looks like there's three main buildings all boarded up. I'm going to look for another way in. I've got a wrecking bar in my truck, though, if worse comes to worse. So what happened to my boss? Is he, like, dead or something? Um... Okay. What's this? A dumpster. Digital voice recorder property of Jill Hager. Good evening. This is Jill Hager of Static Paranormal Investigations. What the you hell? are listening to our weekly podcast, SPI Radio. Every week we broadcast from a different location that is rumored to be haunted. We research, investigate, and discuss our findings. In this podcast, we are in the this is not like an hour long island, podcast. A once booming industrial town. Tonight, we reveal our findings for the Edmont Worsted Industrial Complex, a mill located on the Peters River. I don't know about you, but disappearances I think voice acting adds so much to these games, like especially if it's done well. If it's done badly, then it doesn't help. But. the original portion of the building. It is rumored to be a hotbed of paranormal activity, so stay tuned. All right, so this sounds like some amateur investigator who is investigating this building. Um... I suppose. It's boarded up. Can I use my crowbar to unboard it? Yes, I can. Okay. I still don't know where I should go. There's so many places to go here. The door down here is locked from the inside. Same with the one at the top of the stairs. I'll keep looking for another way in. I think I found another way in, which is that crowbar area. What's this? There's an edge of a buried metal box protruding through the gravel. How do I, can I use the crowbar to get it? You dig at the gravel, unable to earth the box, the rocking bar. Is it like a shovel or something? It's locked from the inside. It's locked from the inside. Alright, so I'll go back this way. I guess might as well go inside. What a hole. Careful not to get lost in here, rookie. I discovered dark hole entry. <laughs> Maybe I should uh, go back. That smell. Yeah, for sure. You hops or key says I can't see force would sound like garbage. Yeah, I agree. I, the guy, this guy sounds very natural. Pile of shredded paper, a little damp and highly combustible. Skybridge door is locked. I'm not sure if I should explore this place first or if I should go back outside and see what else there is. But like. I've already got completely confused. Look, look at this map. It's like... <laughs> this is, like, really complicated. Does it have to be this complicated? Gosh. So can I fast travel? Let's test that out. If I click on this, let's say. I can. All right, that's interesting. 
I, I was going to go in here. What the? That was interesting. So I guess this is just another path that went from one place to the other. What the hell was that? <laughs> NES Friday the 13th map. <laughs> yeah, that one was like a little bit difficult to navigate too. <laughs> I think this one is maybe worse. <laughs> that one, I think this is bigger. Right, let's go to Dark Hole. I don't know where the hell I'm going. Let's go to here. But Thirsty rookie? Well, you're out of luck. There's no water in this building. Not that you'd want to drink from these old pipes anyway. Where's this guy talking to me from? Yeah, it definitely seemed like it was some kind of ghost. Where's I have like this guy's like what is he? I don't understand why where I'm why I'm hearing my boss like talking. Side office. Oh, it's a key to building A. Okay, let's take that. Uh, is there anything else to do here? Looks like no. Oh, sheesh! That that was a little freaky. Can I like rub out the uh, dust from the window? <laughs> I think that was another ghost. What's up here? Why does he keep loading like that? This place is a maze. Take yeah, no kidding. Slow. Don't go getting lost. No kidding, this place is a maze. Oh, progress saying. That's nice. Thank you. Appreciate that. What the? Oh, did I go up here? Okay. Let me go back. What's more shredded paper? It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. What's about here? Dark Check hole. this out. Looks like some bands played here back in the 90s. Awesome. <laughs> Metal lid is stuck. Metal lid of what? I don't know. If I can't. Like, what is that a picture of? Do you see? I don't see this. I see Metallica, I guess. That's what he's talking about on the side here. But what is this thing? I don't see even the picture, This this thing here. Oh, it's this. It's this. I mean, it's so much clearer here than it is in the actual picture. Um, can I use the crowbar on it? Yes, I can. Now what? What's this? Oh, a pick. With this shows TN. Interesting. Okay, let's go in the dark hole stair. Oh, that's back where I came. All right, so. I'm assuming all these other rooms that are locked, I can't go in right now. But, wow, this map is sure complicated. Uh, that was nice. Hello. So where's the other building, building A, that I have a key for now? I don't think I was here. Here, I wasn't here. South Gate, Burnside Avenue, and Mill Street. Okay, this is where I started. <laughs> so weird things are happening, but they're not that free. Ted Nugent. Yeah, maybe. So that's a TN. Yeah, you're right. Beneath the Sky Bridge. This is building C. Let's try the key anyway. I assume it's not going to work, but... Did it work? And... Building A. Does it work, of course. Ah, <sighs> gravel lot north. Gravel lot south. Loading dock. I think I have to look at the map, because... Okay, this is a place to plant a charge, but I don't have any more charges. I'm assuming I don't want to blow the place up just yet. So okay, where, where have I? Not, so this at least is showing me where I've. I, where's the place I haven't been to? It's gotta go here. All right, this is this is the one that was building C. Oops. What's this one up here? Oh. So there's a way to get in here at some point, but presumably not now. Where else? Here. Oh, here's building A, okay. 
So let me go in building A. Building A. So I didn't realize that there's an... I wouldn't have even realized there's like an entrance here because it shows you building A up here, but it was like so small over here. Looks like the local punks are going to lose their hangout. Hope they're not around when we bring this place down. Oh, local punks. Over... <laughs> I hope nobody's staying here. I guess there's some graffiti and stuff, but like... Right, this is where I came from, and I guess this is the way further in. Listen, let's get a charge in that column, too. Yeah, I don't have any charges to get in. Ooh, a key to something. Level 2 Southern Corridor. What happened to the Building A key? I guess I don't need any more. It just disappeared. And this side tube is empty. The warehouse. Oh, isn't that special? <laughs> it looks like this part of the mill had to go at being a thrift store before the whole place was abandoned. I will say, I don't think I've ever played a game before where you're supposed to be a, a demolitions guy blowing up a building. That certainly is, is new. Oil-soaked cotton cloth. Okay, I guess I want to blow something up. That, that'll come in handy. Uh, let's go this way. We got here a tooling room. Ooh, another one of those recordings. Properly of Jill Hager. If you are just joining us, this is Jill Hager of SPI Radio, and I am investigating the alleged paranormal activity inside the former Edmont Worstead Mill. The mill is scheduled for demolition later this month, and this will be my only chance to gather evidence to either prove or disprove the claims from former employees of the building's sordid past. All right, not much there. Metal stairwell. Four slotted machine screws. I can see a screwdriver, which I don't have. I can use the pick. Ah, uh, what? <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> I just broke the pick. I didn't, like, get to force it. That was a cool souvenir. That's BS. I read earlier that it's impossible to, like, get this game into a failed state, so, like, hopefully that didn't need that pick. What was that? I just opened the door. Oh, I opened the door, and I guess it leads to gravel lot south. Oh, so that was the stairwell up here that I couldn't get through. So I opened it from the other side now, so I, I completed that loop. I sort of have a shovel to dig in the dirt over here. So let's see what else. Uh, close that. Where else can I go? That's where I am right now. That's, I guess, the shovel I need to go to. I need to get the shovel to go there. Oh. Stop that. What's this? Okay, so it's. What is what is that that's locked? Can I just move can I just move the, the beam that's blocking it? Let me try the crowbar on that. Nope. I don't think I have anything else that could open that. What is this? This is what is that? A welding rig. Can I use that to open it? Level three entry. What was the key that I got? This is level 2 SC. That was the key I got, wasn't it? Level 2 Southern Corridor. Here we go. Okay. What do we got here? Payphone room. Let's take a quarter. 964 US quarter. I opened up a door. Open up another door. Alright, so there's four different ways to go. Let's try this way. I'm going to have to take the stairs. Fire department must have cut the power to the elevators. Fire department. Basement. So you have basement key, presumably. What's this? It's barred from the other side. All these doors are locked. Level 5 access. It's boarded up, but the boards are too thick to break down with a wrecking ball. Right, what's to do, like, burn it down? Oops. Keep doing that. Oh, I didn't mean to do that either. Uh, this is what I meant to do. 
Can you use like the oily rag? No. I need to get some tools you don't have yet, apparently. Okay, so what else can I go? I can go here. Dark bathroom. Ooh. Another one of these voice recordings. I am now in the ladies' room of the former <laughs> UEC building. In 1983, a young woman named Rachel Kelman, sent undercover by the EPA to investigate some of the employee disappearances, went missing herself. In an interview, a former employee told me that she thought she saw the young woman in the mirror behind her one day after the office had closed for the night. For this reason, I am leaving some objects on the edge of the part. sink with a camera aimed at them. The objects I am leaving are a can of hairspray and a brush. I take the can of hairspray and a brush? I don't see that. No, they're not there. The, lady, the young ghost took it. Uh, hey, now listen. No boogieing on the job, okay? Disco ballroom. Okay, very nice. But I, got a, I got a progress saved. Oops, I just missed that. What did he say? Let me go back. There's a way to listen to all the messages, right? Listen through that. The inventory. Nature always wins, and it's taken back this lot for sure. Check out that weird vine-covered tree over there. It's like the arm of the Grim Reaper reaching out, like the miller's trying to escape from its fate. I sort of, sort of like the uh, the voice acting. Commercial space for rent. <laughs> Not anymore. UEC uses this building for manufacturing. This loading dock looks like crap now, and it's locked from the inside. I remember seeing all these. Hey, rookie. What is that? I think I heard most of these. But I must have missed a couple of them. Look at that. A safe. I should just blow that open and head home early. Eh, it's probably empty anyway. Yeah, it probably is empty anyway. Yeah, that's what I just yeah, I think that's the one I just missed because here's a safe. Okay. It's locked. Can I use a crowbar on that one? Nope, apparently not. What about the safe? Leave it locked, you don't know the combination. Oops. And I guess I can't just force it open. Oh, you know, I'm stupid. I should have used the quarter to open up that screwdriver. I'm not sure if I had the quarter before. But I should have used the quarter to open up that screwdriver thing. Where was that? Was it? I don't remember where that was anymore. And if it was here, then I'm dumb because then I, I had the quarter then for sure. No, it wasn't here. Let's go back to the map. There's a lot of these places that I haven't built to get into. This access and whatever else. What's this? Lock from the inside. I still need a whole bunch more demolition things. Lock from the inside. So there's two places I can get to from here. Yeah, they're both okay. So both these are locked. If they're locked from the inside, how can I possibly get, ever get in there? Unless there's another. Way to get to there from somewhere else. This building C. Don't have that. This is also locked from the inside. This is the digging. This is locked from the inside, and here's the digging thing. <clears throat> Any suggestions are, are welcome. Not that I'm, like, you know, I haven't, like, run out of steam or anything like that. Still plenty more here to do. So where is this? Interesting. It's like, it's like getting undiscovered location. This is the level five access. All right, so that's 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 how some of these things tie together. The fast travel actually is really nice. Um, it's really useful. Okay, this is the safe. 
Where was that? Where was that screwdriver thing? It was not here. Have I been all these places already? Oh. Uh. What's the direction here that I haven't been in? If I look at the map over here. Where's the. I can't, can't, can't close this. I want to get to the map. <sighs> Come on. Get this out of the way so I can see the map. Yeah, so what's this? How can there be an undiscovered location from here if there's nothing... There's no way to go anywhere from here. I don't understand that. I mean, literally, I can only click on whatever's in the, in the corners here. I mean... Am I supposed to do something else with one of these things that I didn't think of? Be. Where else can I go? Maybe it's not a location, actually, that's a problem. It maybe just be just a place that was sitting there with, uh, with a puzzle. I wish I remembered where it was. Metal room. <laughs> That music didn't play the first time. Sign office. That's where I got the key. Skybridge door is locked. Gravel lot north. Here? No, there's a junk pile. Another junk pile. Here. Okay, let's see. First of all, the, the map is where... Where am I? Okay, there's not even like a missing location or anything. So can I use the quarter, like, as I suspected? Hope so. Good. Okay, that worked. What do we got here? L1 basement. Whew, okay. Where is the L1 basement? Uh, let's use the map. I think it was like here. Somewhere around here. Dark hole entry. Fountain room. No. Where was the L1 basement? Wait. Is it here? It's level 3, it said. Don't know what that is. What's the point of this shredded confetti? Because you're supposed to light it on fire at some point. Dark bathroom, level two access, level three access. Oh, here's the basement. All right. Basement. Open the basement. Let's get a charge on this elevator shaft. Yeah, if I had a charge, it would be nice. I don't know if I could do that. Rouge could charge the level one. All right, I got some stuff here. What do you got here? First of all, a digital voice recorder. I'm currently in the basement where Edward Rowe, a textile worker, was cleaning out old equipment back in 1932 when he disappeared. Former employees say that they have heard his cries coming from this area. I am placing a digital recorder in this room 
which I will leave running throughout the night to see if we can capture some of these disembodied cries. Cool. Uh, okay. What else we got here? My pad? What the hell's my pad? Liquor. Okay. What's down here? Get a charge in that column and get moving. This basement is creeping the bejesus out of me. I don't have any charges. Did I mess something up with the charges? Like, another one of these. Before I leave this area, I will conduct a brief EVP session to see if the alleged spirit of Mr. Rowe is an interactive entity or merely an echo. For those who don't know, an EVP stands for Electronic Voice Phenomena. It is believed that ghosts can speak to us, but because they do not inhabit the same plane, we often can't hear them with the naked ear. We have had some luck reaching these spirits through recordings when we play them back with filters and or amplification devices. Cool. Where are you? How can you abandon all your all your materials? Eight foot aluminum ladder. That should be helpful. It's down here. Man, this room sure is creepy. Make sure you get a charge in that column. If I had a charge, I would do it. Oh, what's this? A whole bunch of stuff. What are these again? I will ask a series of questions and record them. I will analyze these recordings later to see if they yield any results. Let us begin. I'm calling out to the spirit of Edward Rowe. If you can hear... I didn't see any speak, spirits for quite a long time. Give me a sign of your presence. Are there any spirits here who wish to speak to me tonight? Please give me a sign that you are here. So, so far this game is not bad. It's just, it's, whoa, I guess there was some kind of sign there. It's a little bit slow. I mean, like, it's not a lot happening so far. I'm just going around like it's a big maze. Rotary hammer cuts hole in stone like butter. All right, that'll be useful. Oh, a charge. All right, another charge. Did the guy like, disappear over here because all of a sudden found tons of charges. Is this like his equipment? <laughs> How many of these were there? Gosh. <laughs> are they unlimited? What's this? Oh, a detonator. Okay, I'll take that too. God, how many are they? I feel like I don't have any more inventory after this. <laughs> I'm going to lose the game. <laughs> yeah, I know it's location tagged for an implosion charge. The service must first be prepared by drilling. Okay, I'll have a drill. Right? This thing? This is a rotary hammer. Is that what they're talking about? I guess so. I wasn't trying to combine those items, but thanks for telling me you can combine items. It's good information. Okay, I rigged a charge there. How many more of these things are there? All right, I'm not going to take any more. I'm feeling like I already... I guess I could put some back, too, right? I don't need, like, five million of them. I know now where to find these things. Okay, I just opened a door, I guess. Yes. Okay, so that was a door that I couldn't get through before. So it's locked. I guess the base of the L is locked the other side. This is where his truck is. All right, so literally, like, we were right next to his truck. That actually makes a little bit of sense. All right, so what did I get now? This has I mean, a ladder, which I'm sure would be helpful, and my pad. Where that goes is, I guess, anybody's guess. Um, that's where I just was, right? What's that? There's another way to go from here? Apparently there's some kind of hidden room here, but... I don't know how... Maybe once you blow this thing up, it, it opens up an area. I feel like I'm about to blow stuff up yet, though. Uh, 
Uh, here was the safe. Can I drill into the safe? And then I have a drill. Oops. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Nope, guess not. It says it drills into stone, but I guess it doesn't drill into metal. Alright, what was this? It's locked. Can I drill that open? Does this drill do anything useful? I, now I have... Uh, I'm sure I can light a fire now, because I have the, the oily rag, and I also have the liquor. I guess I need a, a match or something. Alright, where else can I go here? Where was that disco bowl room? Dark hall stairwell. Rope door is locked. Level three. I could try this, but I'm assuming it's not going to work. Yeah. Where was the, the place where you said the vag like the vagrants were hanging out? Dark hole entry. Level five access. Oops, did not mean to do that. I still can't dig. I'll try to use the, that uh, the drill thing, but I'm sure it won't work. Nope, it did not work at all. I still don't have any type of shovel. I have a ladder. I don't know what the ladder is useful for. Even though I still open that, it still says... I, I opened that already, but it still says lock from the inside, interestingly enough. Alright, um... Oops. What just happened? I'm just like wandering around. I don't want to do that. Uh, let's do back up back here. Beneath the sky bridge. Okay, I need a key to building C. It's locked, it says. Because I can't, you think you could use a ladder here based on the way the perspective of this thing, but apparently not. from the other side. What the? What was that? What's this? I think I missed this before. A ten hole red clay brick. This is like another thing to blow something up with. Back over here. This is too confusing. Where was that place? So, sometimes I'm trying to look at the name of the location and I'm going there by accident. Fountain room, metal room, dark hole stairwell, payphone room, parts room, disco ball room, utility room. Level two access. I guess these are only not that many indoor locations actually. The warehouse. This is where he said the people were like were living, right? That's why I thought looks like I can place a charge here. So you appear at welding a mounting fixture. I have a welder. I don't know if I have a mounting fixture. Okay, that worked. Okay. Objective completed. Still nothing there. <laughs> trying to scare me. Did a decent job, too. Junk pile. This I opened already. Oh, floor grate. Um, this opened up now? What is this? Oh, this is the detonator that was always like that. So I don't want to use a detonator just yet. 
Where else can I go? Parts room. So I need to find out where to use my pad, and I need to find out where to use the ladder. I might as well do this in the meantime. Here's a charge. Let's see appear by drilling. Okay. There's the drill. I'm really becoming a demolitions expert here. I found tons of these these locations. Drilling. 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 Let's keep doing that. It'd be nice if there's an indicator on the map that said where there's some item that you haven't really completely used yet. That would actually be useful for me. It's raining. Or not. It's locked. Level four. I don't have any keys. It's level four. It's boarded up. Okay, maybe I could use the, uh, the drill for that. Nope. Maybe the welding kit? Nope. Come on. Throw a brick at it? No. <sighs> I guess I can't go through there. My pad. What the hell is that? Now there's the roof, too. Oops. The roof access. These ghosts are not too scary. Like, there's no, there's no real, like, it can't be scary when they just appear for a second and they just disappear. It's like, it's not scary. It's locked. Maybe this is my pad. What does it say on that thing? Oh, it does say my pad. All right. It's hard to, it's hard to read it. I don't, again, I don't know where that thing actually is. Okay. Squatter. Looks room. like someone's been living in here. Sorry, bud. Consider this your eviction notice. I guess that guy better get out. Ah, here we go. Building C. What's this? A page for the wound socket monitor. Death of Robert Fallon. The wound socket monitor. September 28, 1997. City selectman Robert Fallon has died in a fatal car accident yesterday afternoon. The accident occurred on Mill Street, and though the vehicle swerved and impacted the Peters River Bridge, the cause of death has been deemed a heart attack, sustained whilst operating the vehicle. Fallon's death comes only months after a proposal to demolish the complex on Mill Street and rezone for condominiums. All right, some guy died. Okay, I mean, like, all right, I guess this lady with a ghost or something. Hey, squatter stash. Oh, I took that already. All right. So I have the key out of building C. Where the heck was building C? It wasn't here, I don't think. Grab a lot north. Whoa. Okay, here's building C. Building C. There's also a window here. Oh, that was that just broke now, so I don't like use the ladder to get to there. No, I can't. Really? It seemed like it would work. So I just can't do anything with that. It's just showing it to me. Oh, it's a partially broken window of the sky bridge. Yes, I see that. So. 
Why can't I use the ladder to get up there? It's not big enough. All right, I'll leave that for now. Let's go here. Dark hey, trench room. Here. There's a bunch of drainage trenches on the floor, and every so often you'll come across one with a missing crate. I speak from experience. Sure you do. Right through that door is the loading dock. Looks pretty good in here. You'd never guess it from looking at the outside. What's this? Oh, loading dock. Okay, that's the door that was locked from the inside. What other ghost sighting now? Ooh, a handprint appeared over here. It's very scary. Let's go to the question mark. Molding. Make sure you get a charge on that outside column. I've tagged the location for you. All right, let's do our job here. Must be repaired by drilling. Okay. But it's an old adventure game trick. The really only puzzle so far has been open the safe with the quarter, the, uh, the screwdriver thing with the quarter. What's this? Grubby note. August 15th, 1881. Dear Mr. Wells, I have spoken with my manager about the working conditions in the mill. The ventilation fan has been broken for weeks now, and there is an awful smell coming from the trench grates. I hope that you are able to fix these issues soon, as it is becoming an unsafe working environment. Russ Hines. It's an objective complete. Find the letter from Russ, Russell Hines. I didn't know I was looking for it. Okay. Machine room. Get a charge in that stone foundation. I've tagged the spot. I won't be sad to see this room go. Frankly, it creeps the Jesus out of me. Okay. I'm actually going to run out of these things. Amazingly enough. Drilling. What would happen to my boss? Another one of these guys. Well, I have found myself in the machine room. It is incredibly dark in this room. Even with my flashlight and night vision camera, the visibility is very low. Okay. Oh, it's a shovel, finally. I can dig out that box. What's Get this? one in that wall over there, too, all right? I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm out of here. All right, let's do that. So tell me it needs a drill, right? Yeah. Okay. All right, south lot. That's the same place right where his truck was. All right, where was that? Uh, I think this was the boiler room. Where was that uh, place for the dig? Uh, I'm confused now. Here? No, it wasn't here. Somewhere around here. Here. Where's the inventory? Alright, good. I got the metal box. Oh, you know, it's level 3 key. And a moldy file. Investigative report. Who's reading this, by the way? 1983. Official report of Rachel Kelman concerning the undercover EPA investigation of Unified Electric Corporation. Summary of findings. The body of attached documentation clearly shows that all levels of upper management, various other key employees, and CEO J.C. Wells were fully aware, complicit, and a party to the alleged accusations of illegal dumping of harmful byproducts and waste of their manufacturing dumping. processes. Furthermore, my findings conclude that on several occasions, employees who would not be party to these illegal operations were at times unlawfully coerced, terminated, and in at least one well-documented case, murdered.
Word. It is my recommendation well that the EPA issue an immediate secession of operations of UEC and commence judicial proceedings to find criminal negligence. Which is word spelled wrong there. Rachel Kelman, special agent, negligence. undercover investigations, I think secession is spelled wrong agency. too. I'm not sure about that. <clears throat> okay. So now I have the, the building three key. Oh, sorry, was it wasn't a building three, it was level three. So here's Dark Hall. Oh my god, it's a light! So scared. Payphone room, level two access, level three access. Whoa, okay, th that was a little bit scary. That looked like, uh. <laughs> <laughs> that looked like, I don't know, like uh, the abominable snowman or something. Oh, it's barred from the other side. I'm supposed to get in there then. This is the key to level three, right? Level three roll up door. That's annoying. Let's have to find another way to get to level three. I thought it was over there. Dark hole stair. Is it here? Here, level three entry. Rope door is locked. Here's a key. Okay. Or this paper. Okay, I opened up one of those annoying doors I couldn't open. That's very good. That was not so good. I feel like these guys don't want to blow this place up. Listen, get a charge in the steel columns. Okay, I'll do that for you. If you're in here, why'd you lock all the doors behind you? I'm really running out of charges. Welding and mounting fixture. What happened? Service repair. Charge set. I have to go back and get more of these. What's this? Oh, another one of these things. Based on the blueprints I looked at when I visited the Historical Society last week, I believe this room is part of the mill that used to house some of their old looms. During my research, the most mysterious of the disappearances was that of the body of Mary Laurier. She was a loom operator who had a heart attack and died at her workstation in 1946. They moved her body to the basement until the coroner could arrive. But when he got there, the body was gone. If my New objective, was leave. That's interesting. Working when she passed. I have conducted an objective, get hell out of here. The magnetic frequency of this room with no effect. Okay. So down here. Radiator room. Or paper. Oh, that's the door that was over, that was locked the other side. Right, okay. What's this? Paper box Holy room. Crap! That's a lot of paperwork. I hate paperwork. I don't blame you. I did this already. More paper. Ooh, a bunch of stuff here. Fink instead locksmiths. Work order. What's oh, a combination Fink for that safe? Locksmiths. Unified Electric Corporation. Called Corporation Road too. Mill Street, Woonsocket, Rhode Island, O two eight nine five. Supposed to be Rhode Island. I guess Rhode Island. They have Boston work, accents also. Place tumblers, company vault. New combination. <coughs> Got it. What else in here? Well, the file of Rachel Kelman. Employee record: Rachel Kelman. Internal employee record. Rachel Kelman, Just read this Social again. Security number 0780511120. Date of birth April 26, 1960. Hire date September 28, 1982. Manager Rick Cole. Termination date July 15, 1983. Give us a year. Reason for dismissal. While Rachel she killed or something? performance in her appearance and duties at her UEC, parents. 
It has become clear that she does not fit well with the established company culture. It was appearances that you're, and you're judged on. Dismissed. Performance notes and details have been removed from this file at the request of J.C. Wells. Nice. A demand letter. <laughs> January 15th, 1982. Law offices of Heard, Fallon, and Berg, Esquire. To Leslie Hart, Head of Human Resources, Unified Electric Corporation. I represent Mrs. Abigail Hines. It has come to our attention that in the wake of the disappearance of one of your employees, a Mr. Russell Hines, there is a matter of two weeks' compensation. That's what she's worried about? Collected. The guy disappeared. She's worried about his two weeks of compensation? Payable to Mrs. Abigail Hines without delay. In addition, concluding a report on missing persons and presumed death, we will seek all applicable pension and or death benefits on behalf of Mrs. Abigail Hines. Sure, Sincerely, Heard, Fallon, and Bird, Esquire. Okay. All right, so... How do I get out of here? Where am I trying to go now? I, I got... What did I just pick up? Oh, yeah, the combination of that safe. Where was the safe? I don't remember. Somewhere in here, I think. Safe room. That would be it. I open it now? Yes. So what's that? Admin office. I'm running out of spots here in my inventory. CEO memo from J.C. Wells. Internal memorandum, UEC. July 12th, 1983. To Rick Cole, head of operations. Feel boring. From. It's reading all these Wells. things. Regarding. EPA versus I mean, I like to read to me, though. Rick, Corp. Rick, I trust you fully talks really slowly, the though. The situation. While there are certain elements of our operations that have no doubt been compromised, I do believe there is still a chance to bury such other undesirable aspects of our business here in the complex. However, time is of the essence. And I trust you will see the appropriate actions taken to protect our investments. Okay. All right. So, what did I just pick up? I forget already right now. Oh, the admin office. Where the hell was the admin office? Oh, that's a little bit freaky. That was very freaky, actually. Where's the admin office? Remember, was it a dark hall entry somewhere over here? Was the side office? Dark hall stairwell. Oh, here admin office. Okay, so let's see the key. Okay. What do we got all, here? All these frame petitions will come down in the blast. No need for a charge here. That's good to know. Um, more stuff. Another key. Skybridge. And UEC office memo. Office memo. Cessation of Quest complete. Operation. Trade secrets, finally. Internal. This is the last one. <laughs> January 8th, 1986. To all department heads. Regarding cessation of operations, in light of the recent court rulings, UEC has been ordered to cease operations. Good. All departments should properly file or shred any outstanding sensitive information <sighs> in accordance with standard operating procedures by the end of day. Please make available any such documents. This game must be almost over because by EPA I found all the stupid papers. Department I feel like I've been to almost every place. So I'm going to set a few charges, I guess, somewhere. Okay. I guess there's still a few places I have built to open up. What was, what was the thing I just got a key for? What does it say? The Sky Bridge. Okay. Sky Bridge. Sky Bridge. Where was that? Not here. What is that though? Okay. It's hard to remember where you've been and where you haven't been. Even though there's a map, it's like really confusing. Uh, dark hole stairwell. Just throw it there. Dark hole entry. Ground, oh, here's Skybridge. Skybridge door is locked. 
opened. Okay. Burn scavenge. to the part of the mill that was destroyed by the fire. Be careful. I have no idea how safe this is. Well, neither do I. Oh, cool. Not much left with this old building. I think whatever's left will come down with the blast. Okay, but what I got here. Oh, nice. A fire axe. It shows TW. We're going to see now if I can. Okay, what I can carry. I'm currently standing in the burned section of the building. A fire tore through this section of the building in June 2002. I found all for stupid quarters, too. Around, as so well that as means I was done. Vandalism and recreational activities from the local teens. It is my estimation that if teen Chris Desier did in fact go missing in this mill, as the local reports state, he may have spent some time in this area with his friends. For this reason, I intend to conduct a flashlight this person test is in weird. this area. <laughs> a flashlight test is when you place a flashlight that has been turned on in an area What's where that a soda? That's not good. activity and invite the spirit to interact with it. I will record these findings and have my report available on our Facebook page for review at the conclusion What's of the your Facebook project? account name so I can look it up? All right, so now I'm assuming I can't take this because I have no place to put it. All right, let me take all these all this crap I don't need, maybe. Like all these recordings. I'll just put them in, inside this thing and leave it here. Hopefully I can do that. Okay, good. This is Chris's ID card. Let's take all this crap. I don't care about this woman. If I have to come back, they'll all be in the same place. And the rubbish pile is probably where they belong. Because... This is just garbage. Oops. Uh, open this up again. Oop. All right. Now where was I? I have a ha an axe now, right? So some things I couldn't to chop down before. What the? Okay, that was a little bit loud. Dark hole stairwell. Uh. Yeah, crawl entry. Wait, where was it? Uh, payphone room. Level two access. Level three access. Level four access. Level five. Another <laughs> skull. Level five access. Right, here's the room that I think I need the, the uh, axe for. There we go. Okay. I have discovered tower attic. More stuff. Level four. What's this? A page for the wound socket monitor. Edmont Worsted Mill expansion. Is the old. Wound socket monitor. June fourth. June fourth, nineteen twenty. Additions and renovations. Additions and renovations of the Edmont Worsted Mill. And work at the mill should resume its normal scheduling. I don't know about you guys, but I have this thing where, with this voice acting, I have to listen to voice acting. I don't know why. I don't see what the point of this is. Employment is expected to double. Very nice. What else we got here? Jurors page of Harrison in mind. The building is not just a place. New quest: dark foreboding places. Closing walls. When a building is erected, you create another space, another world. He has a freaky voice. Old buildings. They get going. Derelict buildings. Creak and moan with all the transgressions of an ill-used, wretched creature. They forget the company of people and thus become dark, foreboding places. To think that a building is merely a pile of... I like the, the uh, visual... Not the visual. The auditory effects they do with this guy. Edmund. All right, so I have the key to level four now also, so I should be able to go here now finally. Level four. Okay, let's go in. Hendrix room. <laughs> what do they call this, the Hendrix room? What's this? A large metal bound door leading to the rooftop. Screw my wedge stock to catch the thin yet stiff can probably release it like a card. I do have that guy's ID card somewhere. Here it is. Okay, so I could go 
here or there. I guess I'll go here first. Junk office. What's this? Empty metal gasoline container. I have all these things to make like a fire. Hey, Hermit of the Forest. How's it going, man? Do I know Warning's Wrath game from 2005? I do not know that game. You know, it was, is it a digital-only like download game? I'm assuming that it is, but, but you, you, you have every single physical game there is, so if there is a physical version of that game, I'm sure you'll, you will tell me. All right, let's go in here. Rooftop. You're unable to reach the ledge, but I have a, I have a ladder, so that's okay. Here's my ladder. Okay. Now what? HVAC room. It's a fuel siphon. Okay. Alright. Hey, Matt. How's it going? You finally made it. You're working late tonight. It's a little bit like the X-Files game, except that it's quite less obscure in terms of, like, you don't have to just guess what to do. Although right now, I think I'm finally at a point where it's not obvious what to do. I still have a couple of charges I need to place to blow this place up. That's my whole... I'm supposed to be a demolitions expert trying to blow up this this building. Although, um... I also have, uh... Herman of the Forest distracting me. What was I say? Uh, I'm trying to blow this place up, but it's also, it's also haunted. And a rare physical release DVD case is from the same developer as this? Morning's Wrath? I never heard of it. Do you have a copy of it? You must have a copy, right? It's an adventure game? I literally never heard of it, but now I now I want to hear of it. Where were the other places I was supposed to blow up? Uh, there was one here somewhere. Yeah, here was a place I was supposed to blow up. Unless you appear by drilling. Of course you have it. <laughs> oh, it's it's an RPG? If it's an RPG, that explains why I did not hear of it. But I'm not sure if you said it's an RPG. You wrote ISO RPG? Oh, you're looking... No, you mean like an ISO, like a CD image, or you're in search of an RPG? I'm assuming that you're saying Morning's Wrath is an RPG. Okay, that's done. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this, like... like I, there's a tank that says flammable. Am I supposed to suck into the gasoline tank? Apparently. Oh, isometric RPG. Got it. I didn't think of that one. Matt says, speaking of blowing buildings up, is there a sim demolition game where you have to plan out explosive strategy or to get the target building to blow to the given area? Maybe. I don't know. I'm not, I don't know what I'm doing right this second because, as you just saw, I just siphoned gas. I have a gas tank now. I have a bottle of whiskey. I have... Um, oily rag but I don't have a match and I would think you need a match to light a fire regardless of everything else I could take the axe and like hit this thing but I, also I don't know why I'd want to light a fire I also have a detonator so there was tons of word rookie where the hell are you I thought we'd oh, run into each other by now I was here before anyway, there's this door I could have sworn it wasn't there before it's not on any of the plans either it's locked up pretty tight, so hopefully there's nothing inside we need to rig. I've also been chasing some dumbass around this place all day. Thinks he's some kind of prankster, knocking stuff over. When I find him, I'm going to tie him to the truck and drag his ass down to the cops. Anyway, <laughs> talk to you soon. I like how it said the voice act, he drag his ass down, but it doesn't say that on the screen. All right, so this is something that opened up here. There's like tons of... Oh, there's... Is this there's 96 of them? Yeah, this is unlimited of these charges. As many as I want, I can take. That's crazy. 96, 95. I don't think I need that many. 
gasoline and whiskey bombs demolish, demolish a building, which is the whole like, beer demolition company. By the way, have you, ever, have you ever guys ever played the game Another Life, Another Lifeless Planet and Me with No Beer? I've discovered Dark Tunnel. Oh, nice. A lot of stuff here. And it was like, it's really dark, so you guys, I almost didn't see it. It's a wallet. Driver's license, Massachusetts State Driver's License. Of Fra oh, that's my boss, I think. Oh, no. <laughs> Objective completed. Find your boss. I didn't find him. I just found his wallet. Explosion charge diagram. Well, that's helpful. That's very helpful. And also, I got matches now, too. Another lifeless planet of mutant no beer is a uh, text adventure. The Great Flood. The Wound Socket Monitor. August 23rd, 1955. David somewhere. John Thule was reported missing while mucking silt from the basement of the Edmont Worsted following the devastating flood of the Black Stone River. The shift foreman reported Thule allegedly oh, discovered here. water draining to a sub-basement with an outlet leading to the Peters River, but the foreman stated that no such room exists. Okay. Missing white mucking silt. Okay, whatever. And I have matches. I'm waiting to pick anything else up because... <laughs> Pretty full here. Uh oh. Shit. It's the first time there was any motion. I feel like I walked. This was the eight endings to this game. Was that just? An, did I just walk into an ending? In tonight's story, oh, come the on. industrial complex of 96 <laughs> Mill Street still stands despite an order of demolition from Mayor Elizabeth Trudeau. Contractor Hamilton Demolition Company. I guess I saw the uh, demolition specialist Frank Galvani to assess and rig the building for implosion. Well, it doesn't matter because I lost anyway. I think. To complete the job and his whereabouts. Mr. Galvani failed to complete the job. This is just another chapter in the mill's dark history, and wondered if the city Come would on. ever see this building destroyed and how many more lives it would claim. I guess I should have known that he disappeared over there, so I shouldn't have gone further. And in other news, town officials are banding together to change policies in regards to our public beaches. I don't care. I hope it's let me continue and like try the next ending, because there's no way in hell I'll do that again. Well, it has been a long night here in Woonsocket. I have spent several hours roaming the halls of the old Edmont Worstead complex, we don't care. and I have experienced nothing that I would classify as paranormal. Though a single sweep cannot definitively determine whether there is or is not a presence, it is my initial assertion that there is no activity. There's really there great vi visuals here. Definite creepiness. Therefore, it is my initial conclusion that this building is void of paranormal activity. Though this is not a determination... We're obviously wrong, because I saw plenty no of ghosts. ...one can truly base their findings on a single night in a location. But with the demolition deadline swiftly approaching, I will not get another chance to conduct a more thorough investigation. Good, shut Based up, Ernie. Based on the evidence I have gathered in this very brief time... All right, shut up. ...that the building, for all intents and purposes, is not... We don't care. Bill Hager of... We South don't care. And SPI we don't CBS care. ...and wishing you all a happy haunting. All right, go, whatever. Come on, I want to continue. <laughs> it wasn't ghosts, all the whiskey and gasoline fumes at this meeting. I don't want to see the credits. I don't give a damn. Continue. Okay, how does this work? I didn't save any games explicitly. Did you? It's like the beginning. Okay, all right. So Listen, I know this door was sealed up. All right, so let me continue over here. That's good. Crack, but it's still. We heard you already. All right, now I'm not going to go forward this time. That was a mistake. At least it lets me continue. The Great Flood. The wound. I'm not interested monitor. yet. You be quiet. August twenty third. Let me take some word. Look, dude, I'm going in there. I'm hoping to God I don't find you in there. This is serious and no time to be playing games. If oh, I want to hear that. I need me to, to shut him up. 
Oops. What was it? What did he say? Look, dude. Look, dude. Look, dude. I'm going in there. I'm hoping to God I don't find you in there. This is serious and no time to be playing games. If I find you in there, I'm going to wring your neck. Anyway, I'm going in. If you're not in there, wait for me here. Talk to you soon. Well, you're dead, so I might be waiting a very long time. Let me take a few of these. Okay, now I have a map, right? A map of where the place to put the charges. Where is the map? Not that. I don't want to combine those items. Come on, I'm not trying to combine items. Lawyer letter. Which was it? This? Okay. How do I use this? Okay, there's a diagram. So how do I see the diagram? Uh, do I have it like in here or something? Oops, I didn't want to do that. Um, let's do that again. Optional file for dub recordings. I did that. Look more the dark blue is a hard sound. Okay, find your boss or charge or charge or charge or charge. Low four junk office. Low four Hendrix room. Rooftop HVAC room. Low five tower attic. Optional leave. <laughs> it looks like those free escape gauges with spoken commentary. Look at the map. I just should show you guys the map. I'll show it to you now, actually. Look at the map for this game. Look at the map. Look at the auto map. In the beginning, like, all these things were, like, locked up and stuff. And it's like, good luck figuring out where you're going. Now at least the route, like, pretty much all the rooms are open. Hendrix room. So here's the thing. I gotta play an implosion charge. Must see your pair by drilling. Okay. Come on, put a charge. Okay. All four roof was right too, right? Yep. Here's another one. Some of them you need to drill, and some of them you need to weld a mounting fixture. So you gotta first click to see what it says, tells you. Okay. Like, I wonder what's in that dark room that killed me. Like, you know, when I say at least showed you, like, what's killing you. What's the monster or whatever. Like, did some guy, like, come and, like, eat you, like, you know, something like that. Like, I don't want to see that. They sort of take it away by not showing you anything. All right, so... Where was the other stuff? Level 5 tower attic and level 4 junk office. So two more. Level 5 tower attic and level 4 junk office. Junk office. I mean, this game is not bad. It's like, I will say, like, I haven't been, like, just spinning my wheels for hours at a time. It's also not been a lot of puzzles. The main puzzle was, like, figuring out to open a uh, locked thing that you just screwdriver with a quarter. Which, obviously, is something which... Which, <laughs> which we've seen before. Alright. Location target for implosion charge. Holding a mounting fixture. This is the last one, hopefully. Okay. Did I get all the charges now? What are you going to say to me? Objective completed? Yeah, 
Yes, set all implosion charges. Okay. Now, I probably want to get the hell out of here. I'm assuming. See, I, there's, I, there's all these flammable things, like I could light paper on fire. So should I do that? I mean, there's all these different things in different areas. Hey, Hopster Key, you came back. I'm just about done with the game. I've set every single charge. I got killed once by something which I couldn't see, which which sucks. I got ending one of eight or something. And now I'm, I found my... I didn't find my... I found my boss's wallet. <laughs> so I guess, like, what's left now is, you know, just blow it up, I'm assuming. So maybe I can go back to my truck and then detonate it. Uh, river path. Where, where the hell is my truck? Loading dock. Right, south lot. Uh, where the hell is my truck? Eastgate. All right, here's where I started. What's this? Sorry, you're at work now. Yeah, that sucks. In tonight's story, the abandoned industrial complex at 96 Mill Street was <laughs> demolished earlier this evening. Contractor oh. Hampton Demolition Company stated that the charges were set by demolition specialist Frank Galvani. She was 10. Only to then walk off the job unexpectedly. A fellow employee of HDC who assisted Mr. Galvani claims his boss went missing while inside the mill. Extensive search of the grounds by police and canine units yielded nothing, and the implosion was carried out as scheduled. Okay. Mayor Elizabeth Trudeau issued a comment, reportedly relieved that the dark history of the abandoned mill complex was finally at an end. So what are the, I mean... And in other news, town officials are banding together to change policies. What, the other ten, like eight endings? What does that mean for this coming summer? Now she's going to say again there was no paranormal activity. Well, it has been a long night here in Woonsocket. <sighs> I have spent several hours roaming the halls of the old Edmont Worstead complex. Come on. And I have experienced nothing <laughs> that I would classify as paranormal. <laughs> she just ran away. Nice <laughs> ending. What am I supposed to do? I mean, it says that they blew up the place. I, I, see, this is what I don't understand. That there is no activity in this area. There's eight more endings. Therefore, it but is an initial conclusion that this it seems to me that... I carried out the job. There's a skip for it. I was trying to see if she said it different this time. It seems to me that I carried out the job. So... Am I back here? Hell with that. I'm not doing it again. I mean, like... I, I think I did it this time because I don't have that dynamite anymore. I mean, like, stay in the building when it explodes. But okay, let me see this here first of all. Did I did I did I achieve all those objectives? No, I I'm not doing this again. Come on. Let's see. The thing is, I carried out my objectives. I I blew up the freaking thing, right? So, and I didn't get killed. Just just run away without playing. That thing wasn't available to run away until now. That that exit didn't exist. Herb in the forest. I wasn't able to go that way. It don't let me go that way once it... Yeah, I saw it's an optional leave. It's, it, But, like, what does that mean? Uh, <laughs> I should stay there and die? I guess I could light those papers on fire, but what the hell's the point? And, I, and it didn't save it. It's bullcrap. It I'm not going to go do that, rig those charges again and waste my time. The heck with that. If it let me save the game, then sure, I would try something else, but, like, do you guys really want me to do this again? I know that, Matt, you just showed up, so maybe you do, but, like, <laughs> it's like a really sober Stanley parable. Yeah, in the sense that there's a bunch of different endings, but but, no, but, I, but I won. Didn't I win? I found my boss's wallet. I, what am I supposed to do? Should I, like, light, I guess I had all that fire stuff. Am I supposed to, like, burn out the dark tunnel and, like, go kill? Yes, do it again. <laughs> Fine, I'll freaking do it again. I don't, know what, I don't know what else to do, though. All right. Let's go do it again. Let's freaking do it again. 
Let's do it again. <laughs> I've yet to find the good ending. Did I, did I find the who cares ending? No, but like, my point is like, why do I have to do it again? Okay, I forgot to get to pick up the charges. I gotta go back and get, get the rest of the charges. But like, what did I not do? I guess I didn't kill the ghost, but like, the, the ghost got, you know, got his house knocked down, so he's dead, isn't he? Like, he was dead anyway. Like, who cares? <sighs> Officer Key says, ring the charges again. Yeah, that guy apparently is dead. That's what we discovered, as he, he seems like he's dead. And we don't care either, because he was a pain in the ass. All right, I'll take some more charges. Take some more charges. I gotta rig up these charges. All right, let's do this again. One more time. One more time, that's it. I'm about to get 20 more times. Hendrix room. Is it the drill this time? This is the drill. It's only, luckily, there's only four charges at the place. Junk office is one here. Welding? No. Damn. I guessed wrong. Okay. I think one more, right? Uh, up here. This one needs a welding thing. All right. That's all the char. That's all the charges, right? All the charges. I'm gonna wring your neck if you don't rig up those charges. Is that the last one? All right, set all the charges. All right, now what do you want me to do? Should I go light light those things on fire? That's the only thing I can think of doing. Uh, dark hole stairwell. Look here, there's like some confetti, a pile of shredded paper, a little damp but highly combustible. There's also one of them here. There's a lot of these, actually. I mean, I got some matches. You want to light this on fire? I'll do it if you want. You want to pour gasoline on it first? Should I put, like, an oily rag into it? I can't do that. I'm going to pour some, like... Oh, okay. I got, like, a Molotov cocktail now. <laughs> uh, all right. Great for starting a fire. But there's also there's all this other stuff here. And also, I got, I got a can of gas. What, what am I trying to do? Imagine light the pier and the early wind extinguishes it. Smoke. I wish I could save. Smoke out. Oh, progress save. Okay, that's nice. Good. Uh, may I put the gasoline on the... Okay. Do I have any more... Oops, I keep pressing that button. Am I out of gas now? No, I still got plenty of gas. And I still have the Molotov cocktail, too. Let's do this one also. Pyromediacs. <laughs> Oops. Uh, crap. Let's light everything on fire. Okay. Can I get out of here now? That's two areas that I that I lit on fire. There was more. There was. There was more of those things for sure, but I, I don't remember where they all were. The poltergeist is starting to become more frequent, maybe. Oh, wow. That was freaky. I don't remember seeing that one before. Boiler room. Yeah, see, I don't remember where all these different... Uh... I'm not going down there. I don't remember where all the different papers were. South lot. Gravel lot north. I mean, I like, something is, I mean, should I just sit here until I die? Because I could probably do that if you want. Where else was the paper? There was definitely a whole bunch of other places with paper. I just don't remember where. 
I feel like I should. It must. It feel like it should hurt. There were question marks again. I didn't see them. Where were they? I hear some more paper. Bird, baby, bird. Do 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 do. do. Begins to travel. Do, do. More paper. Inside different places. I didn't see it. Well, if you see, I'll keep an eye out for it. There's also that window, and I can throw the Molotov cocktail in that window. Uh, paper box room? That was freaky. There's indeed paper in the paper box room. I feel like this is not going to, like, end well. I mean, it definitely seems like I'm going like above and beyond the Call of Duty here to, to get rid of this building. In tonight's story, <laughs> the abandoned industrial complex at 96 Mill Street was destroyed by fire. A five-alarm blaze tore through the building yesterday evening, potentially claiming the lives of a oh. demolition company employees. No, her, Frank let's, let's watch this first. And an as of yet unidentified co-worker. <laughs> I killed myself. Inspection by fire marshals has so far been unable to determine the cause of the blaze, and as of yet, no remains have been recovered. What was the point to that? And in other news, town officials are banding together so, to So, Hermit, the place that you saw, that was a place where um, I went to the first time and I got ending 1 of 10, which was I was eaten well, by whatever the heck that thing was. Um, they didn't show it, so I don't know what it is. I can't tell you. All right. Um, the, only, the only thing I can think of doing is to throw the Molotov cocktail that window. Let me see if I can do that. Where was that? Beneath the sky bridge. Here's the window here, right? Let me see if I can throw the Molotov cocktail in there. Oh, whoops. Uh, oh, here we go. I gotta light it first. <laughs> I'm like a lunatic. In tonight's story, the abandoned industrial complex right. at 96 Mill Street was this, destroyed Was that the same? Fire. Was that... A five-alarm blade... Did I have not enough ten before? Yesterday evening, contract... So basically, I got the fast way of destroying the building. ...in demolition specialist Frank Galvani to assess and rig the building for implosion, but that Mr. Galvani failed to complete the job and his whereabouts are currently unknown. A fellow employee of HDC who assisted Mr. Galvani claims his boss went missing while inside the mill. Alright, so this one I burned it down, but I survived because I was, so I was to outside the, place, the building. And as of yet, no remains have been recovered. And in other news, town officials are banding together to change... Yeah, I did survive, correct. Can I go to that place where the question marks are and throw the Molotov cocktail in there? I mean, that's... that's... Well, it has been a long night... All right, shut up. That's, like, the only thing I... that I think of to do. Yeah, but how do I save him? Like, here... Where was it? Uh, dark. Where was the? Uh, it wasn't here. Where, where was the place where I? Uh, metal room. No. Payphone room. Safe room. I'm trying to remember where was that place. <laughs> Here, yeah. So man, I could try to throw throw the ball to. If I, I don't know if I if I click on that, what's going to happen? Like, I don't know how I access this area aside from uh, like the ball to cocktail. But I can't like throw it. Yeah, it showed this before that I died. Right? It didn't, it didn't actually show any monster or anything. I just died. 
In tonight's story, the abandoned industrial complex at 96 Mill Street was demolished earlier this evening. Contractor Hamilton Demolition Company stated that the charges were set by demolition specialist Frank Galvani, only to then walk off the job unexpectedly. Extensive search of the grounds by police and canine units... This is a different ending, nothing, isn't it? ...and the implosion was carried out as scheduled. Mayor Elizabeth Trudeau issued a comment, reportedly relieved that the dark history of the abandoned mill complex was finally at an end. What happened? And in other news, town officials are banding together to change policies in regards to our public beaches. What does that mean for this coming summer? Stay tuned. Well, it has been a long night here in Winter. All right, I don't know, Fizz. Like, I don't know what I'm, what I'm, what I'm supposed to do, but like, I'm not going to keep banging my head against the wall trying to get this game to do something that it's not that it doesn't want to do, because it seems like no matter what I do, that moron at the end says there's. Can I not use the Molotov cocktail on the icon when I was? The, that's what I did. Is that what I did? And the other, oh, you mean the worker's wallet was? that's what you mean I could try that but I don't think that you could do that yeah we saw five different endings one two seven I think I just crashed the game hold on let me okay I, don't, I understand what you're saying Matt let me try it but first I think I need to kill this thing hold on Serial Darkness Interactive. I don't know why it does that. All right, uh, where was I? Dark Hall. Wait. People room. Level two access. The one access. Utility room. Parts room. All right, you want me to click it on the wallet? You want me to throw the Molotov cocktail at this guy's wallet? I don't know that's going to work. Let's get the hell out of here now. <laughs> okay, I mean like... Theoretically, like, it should blow up something, right? Eventually. But I also... Oops. I also have this uh, detonator, which apparently I don't need to do anything with. Oh, use. I could use... That's different. In tonight's story, the abandoned industrial complex at 96 Mill Street was demolished by an unscheduled implosion. Unscheduled? Local residents were shocked unscheduled? by the blast that leveled the building earlier this evening. Contractor Hamilton Demolition Company stated that the unscheduled blast was likely due to human error in the what? placement and rigging of explosive devices meant to raise the building later this month. A fellow oh. employee of HDC who assisted Mr. Galvani claims his boss went missing while inside the mill. Extensive search of the grounds by police and canine units yielded nothing. Mayor Elizabeth Trudeau issued a comment, reportedly relieved that the dark history of the abandoned mill complex was finally at an end. I don't get it. And in other news, town officials are banding together to change policy. What am I supposed to do? Like, stand out there and be like, Come, spirits, take me! Take me, evil spirits! Like, there's no... I mean, like, th there's nothing to do. It has been a long night here in Woonsocket. Shut up! Alright, that's it. Unless you guys have another idea. I saw... You got to see six endings out of ten. <laughs> I would say the endings in like Shadow of Memories are much better than this, or Shadow of Destiny, or what I call it. I mean, those are weird too, but uh, 
it's pretty much the same thing. It's like he blew up the place, he didn't blow up the place, he died, he didn't die. But not much different happening here. So well, it's been like over an hour and a half. I played this game six times. Yeah, six out of ten innings, not bad, bad, I agree. And uh, maybe we'll go on YouTube afterwards, some other person's channel, and see what the real ending is supposed to be. Because it's just the problem is like I'm not motivated to try to get like four more endings. Like the, the objective of playing a game is not to find all the endings, at least not when I'm playing. I want to get to the end of the story, and like my objective was to get in, blow the place, the freak up, and get the hell out. And I did that, so I win. As far as I'm concerned, I won. <laughs> Over the forest. Where is the boss, by the way? Should you find him or something? Yeah, I guess, but you know what? Like, screw the boss. I don't know the boss from the hole in the wall. He's called me Rookie the whole time, and he disappeared. Maybe, he was de maybe he's dead. Maybe he was eaten. I found his wallet. So what am I supposed to do? Like, go back in there and get killed? It's not even showing me the face of my enemy. I can't just, like, like just get killed for a reason. I don't have, like, a... Like a, a, like a, what's it called? A proton pack for the Ghostbusters. What am I supposed to do? Blowing the place up is not good enough, apparently, for you guys. So I don't know what to do, but I, I consider this a victory. I don't know if I'd recommend this game because it's digital only and it costs like five bucks, but it was very short and fun while it lasted, but the ending is very unsatisfying. I mean, it's because I didn't figure it out, but like, I'm sorry. If I didn't, if I'm doing the right thing, don't let it be an ending. Just, like, give me a clue or something here. I, I don't have any clues of what to do. So, I think the boss is going to rot in hell, unfortunately, Hermit in the Forest. And I am going to go on to my next assignment, blowing up the next building. And we're going to put this whole story and affair of the 96 mil behind us all. So, thanks, guys, for tuning in. I appreciate it. Enjoy the chat, the banter. Thanks you know, for being here. And uh, we'll do this again soon. Have a great evening, day, morning, wherever you guys are. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>